All right, what's up, dudes? Uh, here's the bad news reporting, and um, it's sunny today. <laughs> what the chance of meatballs? Chance of meatballs. Uh, in your yes, face. yesterday it was raining steaks and horses. So I killed the snake. Now we're here. Uh, you can see I have the mask without eyes, nose, mouth, blah blah blah, and a death mask. What, what is it? No nose. So uh, I placed the one with the, the other one already on the thing and I just wanted to point out really quick I think it's kind of weird like these death masks look huge compared to like when you collect them that may maybe I'm just I'm, I'm imagining things but it looks huge down here almost like it was like a, a kind of a, a mistake of continuity yeah well the statues look way bigger than your face you know what I mean so it's like like look at your head and then look at the statues like the st the stone temple head it just looks crazy. Well, not only that, but like the, fr <laughs> the frame of reference, like in the chem the chemical plant room, uh, when you when you said that you saw the mask on the wall. Yeah. Did it, it looks it looks small. It looks smaller than that. But it's supposed to. That's the, that's the that's key. the thing. I think it's a, it's an issue of continuity though. So, which one is it? That one. Yeah. Okay. Boom. So yeah, after. Oh, look at all that blood. <laughs> so after. So after killing the snake, um, the next step is to. Uh, in this game, this is actually added into it. This isn't a part of. Uh, no your, mouth. The OG. In the OG, you have to collect crests. Oh, I said no mouth. It's all of them. You have to collect crests. He's like, oh! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so four crests. In this game, you collect four masks instead. You do collect the crests, or but they're for different purposes in this game. Uh, it's. To use so basically the mask can just take over the crest. Uh oh. What is in the coffin? Um, they just kind of like add extra steps into into the game. It's a crimson oh, head, of course. Cover. But actually, you know who this really is? Who? Oh. Trevor. Trevor. Remember the guy in the diary? Oh yeah. That I was kind of explaining to you. Uh, yes. Well, clearly that's all you have left. Oh jeez. Oh, I forgot to use my defensive item. Oh, bad yeah, news! Push fucking bad news bears! Holy shit! Yeah, bum bum bum. It's equipped, dude. I could, I could very much die here. Oh, he's dead. Dead. Holy fuck! Oh, grave digger! Oh, that was a close one. Phew! All right. And I had two bullets left. The, the reason why I only had this is because I'm trying to empty out this. Is that shotgun shells right there? Okay. You better hope. Well, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna uh, combine those shotgun shells with my current shotgun because I have the assault shotgun now. So I'm All trying right. to use, so I'm trying to use as many bullets as, uh, as this one as possible. But that's Trevor, the guy from the diary. I'll show you in a second. I remember uh, you talking about Trevor when we got the emblem, the gold emblem. Okay, yeah, that one. So like, Trevor's diary. I'm showing the audience. Okay. So like this diary here, talking about the family and blah blah blah. How he doesn't know uh, he's gonna make it out. How he's like trapped and stuff. Well, they hid his body in there, um, and that was him. So, and we just killed his dead body. Yes. I believe what it was is that he was the first Crimson Head zombie experiment. Oh. And um, if you read like diary entries, uh, file entries like later in the game, it talks about how like it's like at the very end of the game, um, you find a diary that talks about like failed experiments with Crimson Heads. Okay. And he was one of them. He was one of them. Uh, Does it say why he was failed? Because he died right away and just didn't come a crimson head right away. I don't remember why it said he why he, why he failed. He was a failed experiment, but what it says is they they just, uh, what they did with his body is put it in a coffin and threw him in uh, the courtyard underground. Huh? Which was there. So, uh, what what was that place you call, what did you call it? You talking about hell? Yeah, hell. So he put him in hell basically. And now we have this this awesome shortcut. Uh, I'm really low health rate. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's a crimson. So, oh, gosh. You gotta combine them. <clears throat> so, I have a choice of either just going, okay, being a man about this, uh -huh. or having to cut the footage and go the long way. Let's be a man. Be a man. Okay. Go big or go home. All right. Is that the man approach? That is the man approach. <laughs> because, <laughs> That's it? No, you have no idea because you, you don't understand. Um, one hit and you're dead, I know. One hit, I'm fucking dead at this point. Is I, there more? That's what I have to be cautious about. 
It sounds like more. Usually dogs pop out here uh, in the OG. Okay. So this is where you would originally put the crests that you find, the four crests. In this game, like I said, uh, the, the four masks replace that. So you, you put the four masks. Whoa, 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 whoa. You stopped and explained. Please. I think there's a first aid spray in here, so I think we're good. All right, well, don't stop. There it is. Don't per stop and talk until you Perfect, perfect, perfect. We did the man approach and we did it. Almost fucked up, though. I know, because you went to explain. <laughs> Holy G Funk. And that era. almost died. Holy G Funk era. Oh, now we got the funk. All right. You better have the funk. Let's continue forward. Ooh. I'm gonna keep getting these shotgun shells, baby. Yeah. So, yeah, and so what I was gonna say to clear my thought is like, basically, like, the remake just gives you extra things to do. Why don't you reload your gun? In a, in a, I'm not doing it because I'm trying to save. Oh. Because if I reload it, then you can't put it into the assault shotgun. Oh. So, uh, is this locked right now? I don't know. No, it is not. Oh, that's right. There's no point going this way yet because I have to get the crank, and the crank is put in a new location uh, for this game. Let okay. me just let me just double check. This is the. Oh, well, there's the radio. Oh, it's Brad. Just give me a sign. Just give me a sign. My name's Brad. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Cause I am Brad. Broken. Oh no. So it's a, it's a one-way radio. Would you look at that? There's a doggy. Snoop doggy dog. They don't see you yet. There's actually a couple dogs. But they don't see you. I know they don't see me. I'm just gonna pick up this shit here. Okay. I'm not. They're drooling, baby. Oh, they're hungry. They're it's been a while since they feast. They're so hungry, it's nasty. Oh, extra nasty. So this game does a lot of just like the remake just gives you extra steps. Like for example, like instead of the four crests, you have the masks, and then you use the four masks to get that uh, umbrella emblem, and then the umbrella emblem emblem gets you to this area. Okay. Where the, in the OG the four crests did it. Mm. So they just give you an extra step. What it is to add to the story. So um, that's what a lot of this remake is like. It's kind of like a director's cut, but like additional things. And don't get me wrong, I appreciate it because it's actually kind of nice uh, that they add all this new stuff in. It's like a totally different game, which made it worth to buy. I, I have the remake of this okay, for GameCube, and I even bought the PS4 version. That just kind of shows you how much I like this. I love this series. And I have the director's cut, the original one. What happens if you push that switch? Wait, we get... Oh, now it's, now it's Barry talking. Oh! And that's where she went. Yeah. It kind of sucks having a radio that fucking doesn't go a few ways. That's like, the, the first one was like that, and it's just like... It adds to the suspense. So, I, I obviously see those things spinning. Yes. I'm not going to stop them yet because... What yeah, happens if you stop them? Because there's a puzzle you got to figure out first. Uh, first of course. course. Um, damn it, I should have brought the crest with me. I forgot about that. Uh, Statue of Blue Eyes. Description reads, the, the last gasps of destruction. Whoops. So what you have to do, um, here's the puzzle. Uh, this is going to say it's locked, and then it tells you the gate will open when the guard dog's desires are fulfilled. Uh, so this is like referring to basically desire, um, desiring of each other. Okay. Uh, so my, my theory in this is just like, you know, when, when this one has an interest in that one, you know, and it's just kind of like, they're kind of looking at each other in such a way. Like he might be looking at him at the corner of his eye, right? Okay. The goal, what that means is basically they don't desire each other anymore with, and they're satisfied when they're not looking at each other anymore. So AKA that means that you have to have them, they're backs facing each other. Ah. So this, so this one's blue, uh, last... It doesn't tell you which direction it's looking in, so we just know that blue is looking this way, which is, let's see, and then red is looking to the left. So blue is looking west. Yes. So we're going to want to make it go east. Okay. So it's going to turn, should do a full 180? No. Uh, let's try it again. All right. Maybe left one more. There we go. So now it's facing, it's back to it. Let's just double check. Yeah, it's yep, it is. Totally is. Okay. Uh, okay. And then the other one uh -huh. is facing 
Wait, wait, wait. So, wait. Let's, let's be smart about this, actually. So, with that said... I went south to north. So, if that's looking north... The other one's looking east. Don't you the have other, to make it... So, the other one needs to look south. The exact opposite direction. Okay. So... This one goes super fast. Oh, super fast for a white guy. And then it goes super slow. And it decided to uh, stay still. Oh, maybe it's already oh, at south. Maybe because it's already at south. So then we want it to go n west. Okay. Yes. There it is. And we unlocked it. So this whole area, actually. So the last room where I got the first aid spray. Okay. You know all the double doors to get to the dogs? Yes. That was all there was in the OG version. Uh, oh. So this whole area is a completely, completely new, completely new to the remake. That's pretty exciting. It is pretty exciting. It makes oh. the game, it makes the game longer, which is a very good thing. Which is always a good thing, yeah. Um, so I need the crest to do anything over here. Uh, so obviously I don't have it, so it's like. But it's actually kind of ridiculous, though. Um, it's just like another thing. It just seems like it was just tagged on, just because they wanted an extra puzzle. Well, yeah, they need one. All you need is one crest. You put the one crest in the one crest slot, and, oh. then, and then it gives you three crests, and then that's it. So it's just like really weird. That's pretty weird. Yeah. So I don't know, but uh, I know there's one zombie in here somewhere. <laughs> Hunting somewhere. Yeah. And I have my, my hunting shotgun, I think it's called that. What, what, what if you examine it? 12 gauge. 12 shows. gauge. A weapon of, is capable of firing wide range. So we're to call it the wide shotgun. But this area is really fucking spooky, isn't it? I remember seeing this uh, when the GameCube version first came out. Okay. Um, I remember like downloading uh, videos on it and like the preview showed this area. It's a creepy, creepy scene. Totally creepy. You're expecting something to jump and get you. <laughs> I've watched too many horror movies, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> or played too many horror games. You never know the difference. But you actually may not be that off from, the, from that truth. So it's just like... It might not be. It might not be. I, won't, I don't know. 